Hey Virgo, welcome on my channel, Tipple to Tarot. This is your bonus love reading, what's happening in your love life. What's the love key on you? The person who you're connecting with, what are they feeling towards you? What's going on? What is their next move? What are they bringing? Keep an open mind, it's a general reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. You can book a personal reading with me. Everything is given in the description box. Sun, moon, rising, any planets if you have in Virgo, you can watch this reading. And also for some of you, this is... Uh, energies I'm picking up so energies can be reversed role can be reversed just take what resonate let's see what's happening what's the love tea on you what's going on with your person so I saw the king of swords so you could be dealing with Gemini Libra Aquarius let's see we have a strength Leo energy popping up so you could be dealing with Leo okay, let's see what's going on with your person we have two of swords energy Nine of Swords. So you you stop talking to this person or this person is not talking to you. Yeah. Six of Pentacles. We have the Sun Reverse. Yeah, definitely strong Leo energy. And we have the Moon card. Sun and Moon. Wow, really? Bottom of the deck is a King of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be another Earth sign. But this could be your energy too. Okay, so Leo is popping up. And we also have the Moon card. Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Look, we have the sun and moon energy here, right? And we know that it's a yin and yang energy, masculine and feminine. It doesn't matter whoever you are, but we have the sun and moon, so it's like soulmate. It's like twin flame. Whatever you want to call this connection, yes, it is. But you are not together. You are in a separation with this person. So this person is feeling left out in the cold by you. They feel like they're not happy. Their life is not happy without you, with the sun reverse here. They're not happy. They're not happy that the way things are. They're not happy that you're not talking to them. They're, they're not happy that you're hiding your feelings from them. They're not happy that you are strength and the moon card. You, you maybe ghosted this person. You stopped talking to them with the two of swords. They're not happy that you're pushing them away. They're confused. They're confused like why you are doing this all stuff. With the nine of swords, this person can't sleep at night to thinking about you. Or this is someone who maybe give you this anxiety in the past. Or giving you anxiety maybe currently. You're not sure why this person is not talking to you. Why this person is not making a move. Strength card. This is definitely a very strong soulmate twin flame connection is. This person has a lot of emotions and desires and feelings for you. But they're not telling it. For some of you this person can't express it. They don't know how to express this much emotions and feelings they feel overwhelmed by these emotions with this energy here they they never experienced this for some of you or you never experienced this type of a love with this person with the six of pentacles energy here this person definitely watching you from afar or you maybe see this person every day this person could be your colleague your worker i don't know you work together you see this person every day wherever you go i don't know whoever this person is with the six of pentacles this person really want to give you now equal give and take if this was not equal give and take then now they definitely want to put the effort here. They really want to. They really want to date you. They really want the balance with you. I'm also seeing the birds here. So you could be seeing chipping the birds and sunflowers and butterflies. So this person wants to deliver the message. They really want to speak up. With the sun and moon coming up together, this is definitely your soulmate. This could be same gender sex relationship too. For some of you, does not have to be. Um... I'm also getting one energy from this person like they could be show the on the upper side on a surface like they are masculine with the moon uh, with the sun and king of pentacles obviously it's very masculine energy here but in reality they are more feminine like they they're hiding their true feelings they don't know what to say yeah king, king of pentacles and page of cups and wheel of fortune bottom of the deck yeah expect a message from this person they could be secretly watching you with the moon card you could be a tarot reader, intuitive, psychic by yourself. So this person is into you. This person all about you. They, they're going to send you a message very soon. King of Pentacles and Page of Cup. Uh, there could be an age gap for some of you. Some of you, this could be the baby father or mother. Are they, they are behaving. I feel like whoever this person is, again, I'm getting like there's some duality here about this person. Like they, they show like with the King of Pentacles, like they're very mature. They're, they could be sensible. They could be working hard, but in, in romance, in love, they are page. So they're not experienced that much, or they don't know how to express these feelings. 
So you're dealing with someone who is not that much expressive. They could be quiet or they could be very controlling of their emotions and feelings. They feel like it's a weakness. They don't want to show it. They, 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 they don't know how to express it. This person can't sleep at night. They are worried about you. They're, worried, they're always thinking about you and this connection. Yeah, this person really wants to come back. This could be someone who lied to you about their feelings and now they're regret regretting it. You maybe directly ask this person, like, you like me, you love me, and they said no. It's, it's a no. Even though your intuitions are telling you, like, this person likes you, this person is your soulmate, this person has feelings for you, but they lie to you. Are they lying still? Now, let's see. What's the love to you on you? This person definitely see that you're their soulmate. They're not happy without you, whoever this person is. They're not happy the way things are. They messed up. They, they screwed up everything. I'm getting. They screwed up everything. Yeah, seeking guidance. This person could be getting some type of um, readings on you. You know, like psychics and tarot readings on you. Or you could be the psychic and tarot reader by yourself. So you know that. You intuitively with the moon card, you, you know that, what this person is feeling. This person is not happy. They are not happy without you. I can feel this person energy. They can't sleep at night. You blocked this person or they blocked you. We also have motivating. We have a don't leave. This person does not want you to leave. No, they don't want you. Yeah, they don't want you to leave. Like, look, this person is saying, don't leave me. I feel like you're picking up this person energy already. You blocked them. You moved on. You're definitely self-motivating right now. Or this person with the king of pentacles uh, energy here is with this money is right now motivated with the money. Like they're, they're too busy. They're making themselves busy in the work. So they they should not think about you. But they can't help but missing you and wanting to be with you. They're not happy. I told you this person is putting its, its duality on the world. Like they're happy with the king of pentacles. Everything is fine. Or this could be your energy, Virgo. Because this is you, earth sign, right? You guys are because earth signs are like this. They don't show their feelings. They, they, they definitely try to portray it like they're okay. This is someone who wants you to don't leave. You block them, so unblock them so they can talk to you. And for others of you, this is someone, yeah, look at this, drain. This person is drained. They're crying over you. They're, they're drained by this situation. They're drained. They're, they're definitely not happy with this. The sun reverse. They're not happy. I'm also seeing this person can't eating well. They're not eating well. They're not sleeping well. They're not taking care of themselves. Their health is not good. Whoever this person is with the sun reverse here. Their health is affecting this. They could be getting this as a anxiety with the nine of swords and drain energy. I'm getting you. Depression could be. We also have both acting like brats. Brats. Yeah. Look at this. You both are acting weird. Even though you both don't want. It's Okay. I get it. And I feel like, look at this, and the, at the end, it's the spirit babies. And we also have this both acting like breads. So universe bringing and giving both of you signs, like go back to each other. Because you both don't want to leave this connection. You both love each other. You both are stressing and drained because you're soulmates, you're twin flame. But no, nobody's giving up on it. You both have processing through ego. Definitely spirit is protecting this connection and wanting you to be with this person. This could be someone that who is, um, I told you, like your baby father or mother. You love each other. Both acting like brats, okay? So this is someone who's drained, stressing out. They can't sleep at night. Drained because you're leaving them or you left them already. They don't want you to leave. And you both, but they're, it's like you guys are too, this is a baby's energy here. So you both are acting very childishly toward this connection. Yeah, this, or maybe this person did this, okay? This is someone who is motivating, motivated by money. They're also, I'm, I'm hearing this person is losing motivation too in their life. Like even though they're working, they're not happy with the Six of Pentacles, even in their work situation, wherever they are working, they think about you all the time. They're drained, they're not happy, they're stressed out. I have, I fantasize about you loving me again, loving me again. Yes, this person wants your love back. They want you to not leave. I feel like you're better off without me. This person, this is where this person is very stressed out. Like they feel like you're you're going to choose someone else. You're not. We are king and queen type of love. This person sees you only you, only perfect match for them. 
Sun and moon, yes. Made for each other. They, they definitely want you to don't leave. Don't leave them. I dream about being close to you. Are you seeing this person dream in your dreams? Like they want to meet you. They want to see you. They want to talk to you. So this is like universe is guiding you toward this person. I think about you as soon as I open my eyes. This person is going crazy about you. Like over you. There you go. My soul longs for every part of you. Oh God, this is soulmate. This is your soulmate missing you. This is your twin flame. For some of you, if you're single here, maybe this person is longing for you. Wherever this person is. Maybe you're seeing this person in your dreams. Are you longing for your soulmate? I don't understand what you see in me. So this person is insecure and drained. They could be insecure about their body. They could be insecure about themselves. Yeah. Their insecurities are stopping them. Look at this bottom of the deck. I have cried swimming pools of tears for you. I told you this person cried over you. This person crying over you. They can't sleep at night. This person is going through a lot of stress right now. Their health is not good. They're not happy without you. If you feel intuitively like whoever this person I'm talking about and you are dealing with this person already, obviously, because you know them, unblock them. Reach out to them. They need a hug. They, need, they, they want you. They don't want you to leave them. I feel lost and lonely without you. This person is crying over you. They can't live without you. You need to reach out to them. Okay? This is your soulmate. This is your twin. This is your opposite. Sun and moon. Yin and yang energy. Okay? So that's your reading. I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye. God bless you all.